Hello everyone, it's me, Mrs. Gronert, and today we are going to read the story, Little Spider Spins a Web, written by me, Mrs. Gronert. One bright spring day, Little Spider was flying through the trees on a line of silk. As Little Spider was flying, she saw the perfect spot to spin her web. The light from the sun was shining right on the spot. It was a tree branch that seemed to stretch across the pretty meadow. Little Spider could see flowers and grass. Little Spider could see flies, mosquitoes, and many other insects flying past. Yes, this was the perfect spot to spin her web. Little Spider crawls to the perfect spot on the tree branch. She flies right across the branch on her silk thread and makes a bridge. She flies across again, making a loop under the bridge. Then she crawls to the middle of the loop and sends a line of silk down, down to the bottom of the branch, making the shape of a letter Y and pulling the line tight. Next, little spider crawls in straight lines across the web. These lines are called radial lines and help to support the web. When all of the radial lines are finished, the little spider crawls back to the middle of the web. Then she begins crawling around and around and around, forming beautiful spirals around the web. These spiral lines are called orb lines. The little spider is getting tired, but she is not done. She takes a short rest at the side of the web. Last, she crawls around and around again. This time she is making sticky orb lines with her silk. The sticky lines will catch delicious insects for little spider to eat. When little spider gets to the center of her web, her web is done. She sits and rests. Little spider can see flowers and grass. Little spider can see flies, mosquitoes, and many other insects flying past. What is that? Little spider feels the web move quickly. She crawls to the place where the web is moving. She sees a fly. Little spider crawls to the fly. She does not have to fight. She bites the fly and wraps it in a cocoon of silk. Little spider's venom will stop the fly from moving and turn it into a delicious lunch. Little spider crawls back to the center of the web as day turns to night, little spider thinks to herself, yes, this was the perfect spot to spin a web. I hope you enjoyed the story today, and I hope to see you again very soon.